time we will do it together. I was about to say that. Stellaris has a new cooperative mode that lets two players play as the same empire at the same time. But what if those players were secretly pursuing different goals for their empire? In this video, we're going to find out who the imposter is. Let's dive in. Start your engines. <laughs> I'm just going to quickly go through the settings just so everyone understands the kind of peril we're in. Our overall goal is that we need to unite the galaxy in one giant federation before we die. Just like we did with Earth. Yeah, just like how Earth is hunky-dory. Why is it we're going to die? Well, at year 50, we have the end game and a 25 times crisis coming in. A random crisis that we will be completely unable to prepare for. We also have some secret goals and we'll be deciding who wins based on those secret goals. I don't know EP3 he doesn't know mine. Uh, we'll also be taking over some specific roles in this co-op. So I will be in charge of the government and diplomacy and EP3 will be taking on the military role that he's always longed for. Yes. Good. Edda. Dolores Mwanga is the leader. Ah, oh, I've got to love Dolores. Don't you love Dolores? Yes. Who we got? We've got a lithoid and two lithoids. Wow. Xenophile militarist uh, materialist and xenophile pacifist materialist. They love each other. I think they have a lot on it. Well. No, we've got continental war right next to us. Look, they're serious. One thing we need to mention is in order to make sure that this co-op game does go smoothly and it's not just two bickering old women, once somebody makes a decision, i.e. once we pick a technology or begin building a building, the other person cannot undo it. <laughs> I'm just going to click all the buttons. <laughs> Have you picked any text yet? No. Uh -huh. Aha, then I get to pick the text. Whoa, oh, damn it. Science. No, damn it. I was gonna, should we, um, should we get going there? Hey, no, you can't accept the embassies. That's my job. Hey, oh. <laughs> that's my, stop. Get back in your cage, military man. What are you doing? Stop that. <laughs> what is this? How are you doing that? I can do it too. No. Are you looking hard enough? My gameplay right now is build the outpost when it's done. Should we go to fast? There's no need to go to fast. I enjoy staring to the depths of the sun. Did you start building a colony ship? Yeah. Oh, you fool. It's fine. It's not fine. There's an arid world below that. We can use the migration to get it, I think. Uh, Yeah, we can. There's also double tundra. They're going to get that one, though. I, yeah, think. I think so as well. We can try. Do you want to roll for it? For what? Who gets Earth and who gets Sirius? I'll take Sirius. But I can't manage the Federation then, right? No, the Federation's my baby. We should probably put envoys in it. Oh, yeah, I didn't think of that. An idiot. <laughs> Absolute idiot. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. Get out. It's just a lone defender. We can fix that. We, oh, can. Okay. we now have our first planet in the name of our great Admiral E.P. Frio. Mm -hmm. E.P. Frio's keep is uh, fully operational. Well, it's all right. I've renamed our capital in honor of our glorious diplomatic call. Welcome to Montu's Palace. No. Just managed to get that zero G lab in before you could research some awful military technology. Oh. You warmonger. What other options were there? Oh, the other options were so yeah. good. <laughs> No, we don't need blue laser or combat computers. Far too militaristic. No, there's peril behavior. Of course, there's a loud minority at EP3O's keep. You bunch of degenerates. We love breeding. A Gaia world. Ooh. Hello, sailor. And it doesn't look like it's a holy world. <gasps> we were starting to expand out into the galaxy. My secret goal was to use my skills in diplomacy and bring as many empires into our federation as I could to create a grand coalition of equals that might not have a chance of surviving the crisis, but would still do so united as brothers in arms. This was a role I was um, definitely suited for. I do possess the subtlety of a sledgehammer after all. What EP3O's goals were remained a mystery. All I knew was that his goal ran counter to mine. Ooh. No! No, you just lost the entire fleet. Are you kidding me? Why? It was disgusting. We tried to take it down. We lost our great admiral. You know what I was thinking? That we needed some supremacy. Oh, for the, no! Why? Why would you click that? There's a dimensional horror that we need to uh, take down. We're getting some factions. We just got the one faction. <laughs> the free thought watch with 100%. Egalitarian. I think we should promote them, yeah. Yeah, uh, the Alien Compassion Network just oh. fired. They are happy as well. 100% percent approval i tell you what, i'm doing a great job with diplomacy here this is clearly part of my oh. role as diplomat in making everyone happy no 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 it's because ep2 nils <laughs> what's that about ep2 nils keep no <laughs> here you go we fix ep2 nils keep 20 percent pop growth speed though now and we can get some gases why has ep2 nils keep got such high devastation what have you been doing over here we were breeding too much we got a bit rowdy 
Why are we in combat again? Uh, Why are we dying? Um, Why have you lost two fleets? Um, Why are you in charge of the military? We have negative unity. What? How are we got net? What? Political fall. We're using 80 from our leaders. Oh no. Oh, we need to get leader upkeep. That's, that's, that's our bad. That's our bad. We've kind of run this civilization into the ground. No, no, no. We're not making any unity. Um, we could get, uh, you know what? We should probably get rid of one admiral, one scientist. I'll put an auto cathode monument on the capital. Oh wait, we're making 30 unity now. The ho ho. And that's because of my genius. You have to agree. The next thing is psychological profiling. That will reduce our leader cost, which is the main unity okay. killer. Yeah. By 25%. I'll allow it. Oh, that arid world's a very good energy world. We should get that arid world over here. Minus 10% habitability. Yeah, but we can just put the glyphoids on it. How do you feel this is going? Um, Like, we're almost halfway to the, the end game year. Oh, no. And we haven't found anyone else yet. And we found someone who's aggressive towards us. At this point, I was really starting to worry. Without any alien contact, it would be impossible to complete not only my secret goal, but our public goal as well. Uh-oh. We have a slight issue. I'm sure the military can handle that. They have way more than us. I'm sure the military can deal with that, right? If only we were allowed to take some military. We're building two hangar bays on Quafra. Oh. Oh, we've got a fanatic purifier. <sighs> right, prepare the defenses. Give me all of the alloys. We will murder them. I'm authorizing full control to be passed over. We no longer need consumer goods. To be locked behind a fanatic purifier for this entire challenge. What a great co-op run. Excellent. Who needs the 25 type crisis when we've got a Grand Admiral fanatic purifier next to us? I'm going to close borders. I'm going to send an insult and declare rivalry because I'm sure, I'm sure that my military will be able to handle this. Nope. Wait, turn one of your fleets on to take point because oh, the Harmonious yeah. Torvright Collective has 2k. Okay. Maybe we can go actually. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking. Okay. I'm going to upgrade the board. Oh, you just built up. I want it at Kepler, so it's slightly further back. Oh, they've insulted us. Your species seems to grow more and more disgusting by each passing day. Human. <laughs> okay, let's see then. There we go. War. We're at war. We oh, no. will fight them on Kepler. Being at war was less than ideal, as it meant we couldn't invite anyone into our federation diplomatically. This might be an issue for me if EP30 won't stop with all of his warmongering. We can take them. Look at this. Hey, maybe I wasn't too crazy to put, put my faith and trust in you. Don't go too fast, though. Why do we have no shields? Shields are for the weak. W where are our shields? What do you mean shields are for the weak? We need like a bit of shielding. Shield is for the weak. And I have a lot of concerns. Their star base is weak. They brought 7k. Why aren't they coming? Oh no, my screen. We fight them. Are oh we no. We're not winning. Fall back, fall back. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> need disruptors, that's the issue. Come and defend the star base. Oh, they're dying. We might get there in time. It's not going to help. It will. I don't know. Maybe it'll help. Go. Save the star base. Oh. oh. <laughs> our military did something. Believe. Disruptors. Okay. Oh. This is our time. Oh, uh, wait, wait, wait. Wait for the allies to come. What are you doing? You're going it by yourself. You don't have the power. I don't know if we can actually kill their star base. <laughs> are you winning? Yes. Okay, you won. Yeah, fine, fine, fine. You did win. Well done. Indiscriminate bombing. Oh no, I've made a mistake. Oh come on, why? Why would you kill us again? Why are you charge the navy? Why has this been allowed to happen? It's ridiculous. They're dying. Maybe. Oh. <laughs> They're coming with seven k. We have one <laughs> point. All right, status quo. Send this peace offer. Send the peace offer now. Send it. Send it. Oh, we are yet to bring anyone into the Federation. Excellent job by us. Teamwork makes the dream work, I hear. Yep. What can we afford to give away? Favors. Oh. Uh, Giving away some gases and some favors. Uh, it's part of the diplomacy plan. We can't do anything. Oh, now they're cordial. Why don't we do... Um, I mean, I want to do shared destiny. But probably the best one for us to do is transcendent learning. Yeah, I agree. I think we need a vassal, to be honest, for the resources. Imagine taking one of these and getting taxes. All of our problems would be solved. What? More humans? Excellent. Just going to give them a couple of favors and some free resources. Here are some exotic oh. gases. We don't need them. 
There's a hundred ninety exotic gases. Beautiful. <laughs> no. I mean, what are you gonna do? Spend it on the military? Yes. There we go. Subjugation. No, don't make them a bulwark. We can take oh. their resources. Take their resources. Propose oh. a tribute tree. It will fix everything. You'll have all the minerals and you can turn Monty's paradise into what you want. And then we can focus on the bigger issue, the punishers. I can work wonders with this contract. I'm doing tribute tree with extra steps. Bringing a vassal in might help our economic situation, but would not count towards my secret goal. Currently, with only 10 years to go before the crisis, I was yet to score a single point. <laughs> what a good deal I just set up. Take a look at the oh, deal. Oh, that's good. We can go another ascension pick. Shared Destiny could be good, actually. I think Shared Destiny. Spy on the, the Republic above us. I'll happily do Shared Destiny. They're superior. Oh, they're at war with someone else. Who? Purifier. Maybe it's oh, they went to war with the purple to the south. Maybe it's our time to strike together as one. I mean, they are superior to us. 592 and we are at 283. They have double our fleet power. It's fine. What, what do you mean it's fine? Don't worry. What do you mean don't worry about it? We charge. What do you mean we charge? Wait, time out. Oh, you've got disruptors. Okay. 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 I can see this. Things keep popping up and it's so annoying. I literally got my fleet. Okay. No, we find it's fine. Another fleet coming in. Are there only 3k? Yeah, they die. I think we're fine, actually. We can just charge. Oh, how did the authority grab that? Go first. You need to go first. Oh, no. No. They're taking it all. There's so much going on. The crisis can spawn. Oh yeah, yeah, we're at year 50. The crisis can spawn and we haven't even, we brought one person into the Federation. Oh, you're, you're decimating them with those disruptors. That's what I wanted to do to you, but. <laughs> My shield hardening completely hurt you. The ghost signal. Already. No, 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 no it's not fair. <laughs> not like this. <laughs> not like this. Um, the star base is wrecking us. What? Status quo. Status quo. Please, can we status quo? It's fine. Come on. It's fine. Oh, the AI took it out. Well, they took out the star base. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. They did what you could not. Do you have enough armies to take the capital? No. It's fine. But the contingency is coming. We got to do something. Oh, not good. Why can't we peace out? Come on. We can, we we can win. Planet. We're not, how can we win? We've got no ships. We do. Where? Oh, okay. You got 12k coming. All right. 12k of Corvettes with tier one disruptors. Oh boy. <laughs> Where's the first one? That's not near us. That's fine. That one's not near us. That's fine. That one's not near us. That's in the Commonwealth of Man. That's fine. Good. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, that's not fair. I can't even read these. 14 million. 14 million. Oh. All right, let's go to normal. Um, I think I think it's time you end that war. We're, we're winning. Why do they have so many Trump? Please end the war. Oh, I need to take their capital. It's my goal. You, we didn't even know they existed. How could that be your secret no, it's goal? it's not my secret goal. It's just my goal in life. Please, please, please end the war. We need to be at peace to protect ourselves. They are like four jumps away from our capital. For the love of God, end the war. We need to accomplish something before we die. We can just end the no. war. I promise. I promise. No, 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 no. I just say no. Just end the war. It's almost over. We're bombing them. They're like, they're two jumps away. I'm literally taking it. I'm almost there. Yes, I'm taking the capital. You sound like you're on the toilet. We did it. Yeah. Now we can take more things. Just end the war. They're in Alpha Centauri. They're, they're going to be on our capital. They're all. Oh, they're in. I told you. I was. Okay. Okay. I've, I've sent it. I'm waiting. We're crumbling. No, we're expanding. I'm doing it. We must last stand them. The fleet's going in. <laughs> no, don't send the fleet in. If we keep a fleet, we can have a higher military power than our rival, our neighbor. Just run away with the fleet. This is such a mess. Well, look, the Federation has got bigger. I've just brought in the Parian Empire. Soul is gone. No, no, no. It'll be all right. We're still flying half a ship. Yeah, see, we got Sol back again. It's all fine. Look, our economy's doing fine thanks to that vassal that I got for us early. I'm going to renegotiate that contract. I'm going to renegotiate into a give us everything contract. Now they're going to give us 60% of everything they're making. We could go orbital rings. Yeah, that will definitely help. No, there's no use in orbital rings. They'll just die. Seven, you've just wasted. You've just like stopped us researching engineering ever again. The other options weren't very even. Oh, and I should feel good about that. Yes. 
Right. A lot of people have an issue with the authority of Strintal. They're one of our Federation members, one of our starting members. They've got no fleet and the contingency is like all up in their space. Should we just kick them? We can kick them and make them a vassal. Yeah, no, let's kick them to bring other people into the Federation. And then we can make them a vassal. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, okay, that's a good deal. They wrote no. <laughs> Damn it, we failed. The contingency is completely eaten the fanatic purifier that used to be here. Because my military um is stuck, I'm gonna do some uh, diplomatic vassaling. If that's uh, I'll, I'll take that off your hands, Bond. Yeah, I got a lot on. I'm trying to do the economy right now because that's burning somewhat. No, the synth assassinated Dolores Mwanga. That's not fair. We don't even have robots. Oh. Okay, well, we've got our first vassal. I've had to give them some science. What do you mean our first vassal? I mean, our first vassal of uh, my diplomatic reign. Well, who did you get? Old Kana Nation. Oh. No, at least they'll join the Federation now. No, they're inward perfection. What is wrong with me? Oh, I can make them a vassal. I can make them a Federation member, but they're inward perfection. It's not fair. Commonwealth of Man wants to be a bulwark. No, decline. We can't afford it. But I have another plan. We just need to kick these other people. I've got them. Don't worry. No, 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 don't, don't do it. Just stop. Just think. Just I will think. limit their diplomacy. What? They rejected it. Thank God. Thank God. They said yes. <laughs> try again. No, no, don't you try again. It's my go. Let me have a go. <laughs> they keep saying no. It says yes. I was honestly right on the edge of my seat here. The constant refusal by the Commonwealth to become our vassal was music to my ears. I was desperately trying to bring them in as a free member of our Federation. The game was very much afoot. They're lying to you. They don't want your help. Stop wasting our unity, uh, our influence. Why do they keep saying that? Stop, Stop wasting. wasting the unity, sir. It Stop. literally says, yes, they will do it. Come on. <laughs> no. come Why come do on. they keep saying that? Come on. No. Why are they saying no to, to, to coming to join our federation? They want to join us, but they also don't. Oh, Great Vuren Alignment. Who the heck is the Great Vuren Alignment? Oh, the Tavuchin state just, right, they can get, they just became a vassal of the other people in. So they got out and then they came back in again. <laughs> now it's going to work. Now is the time of our ascent. Come on. Yes, 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 we got them in. But our original allies, we've thrown them to the dogs. What happened? There used to be an M. Oh, I think the interstellar Yabrak Confederacy had a machine uprising. The Kelbra Junction. I'm, tr I'm trying to get a war to vassalize them, but people are saying no. So how about that war debt being majority? I mean, I'll suggest it. I don't think it'll pass. No, I was going to vote no. Oh, uh, the Kelbra Junction are coming. They've got battleships. They're really strong, actually. What, what are you doing? No, this says they're pathetic, though. But our fleets are not in the right location. The issue is that the purifiers um, close borders now, so I can't get out as well. You know how to solve that one, don't you? Yeah, I'm tempted. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Don't worry, I've done it on your behalf. Oh, thank you. I mean, the galaxy is kind of dying to contingency. We've almost united it. I'm murdering the purifier. I've given association status for the independent Barclan Commissariat, and they have two vassals. You're welcome. We just lost a world. Fine. What what world did we lose? Why do you keep losing Bejeweled? How is it you managed that? Oh my goodness, they've got massive fleets. Quick, do something. I'm killing them. Yeah, okay, that was oh, that was fast. Oh, that was very fast. Oh wow. Don't you worry. I can't believe the galaxy isn't dead though. No, they're just it's thirty years and like the the eastern side has never even seen war. There we go. I killed them. See? Oh, I clicked the wrong button. I just gave away a planet to primitives. You know what that means, though. We have another vassal. Uh, no, we have another Federation member. Uh, three ships got no, called. No, 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 no. What are you doing? The game's going too fast. Why did you kill I couldn't micro it. I couldn't micro it. Oh, for it lit the literal pop-ups and everything. Oh, no. There's more. I didn't realize there was contingency inside us. The contingency was inside us all along. Did we just lose a lot of fleets then, did we? No, I retreated them. Yeah, we're doing it. Are you winning the war? Oh my goodness me, you are winning the I'm war. One war, now we win another. I mean, you've not won a war yet. No, I won against the purifiers. Not really. The purifiers don't exist. Oh, 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 sorry. Yeah, that final war. Yeah, that is a good point. You did win that final war when they'd been crushed by someone else. Yeah, yeah. I'm not sure if you won it or the contingency. No, we, did we, mm, we did it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. Why are there no entertainers? The reason we're having a revolt is the game decided to unemploy all the entertainers. And it's continuing to unemploy all the entertainers. What are you doing? Stop that game. Game's smart. Ah, uh, we dismissed. Oh, you you were so close to being killed then. Oh, you did get killed. Where are your fleets? Oh, no. Oh. Did you just lose all your fleets? 
You know, we only have to make one more person. We just need to get the independent Barkland Commissariat in. The contingency need to go mess up the east. You know what we should do, don't you? Crisis beacon. Because if we weaken them, we can make them a vassal or invite them or something, and then we're done. We'll have united the galaxy, uh, except for the original people that were in the Federation, but they don't count. They're in the Federation. No, they're out. I thought they were a vassal of someone. Uh, yeah, so I kicked out the somewhat. What? Well, I was trying to bring the Commonwealth of Man in. The Commonwealth of Man wouldn't join if the Great Vurum alignment were in. So I kicked out the Great Vurum alignment. Then they became a vassal. Oh, we can get them in again. Wait, why are we at war? No, what are you doing? That doesn't, that's not fair. I'm fixing it. But they've got fleets and we don't. Fleets meet. No, why did they engage? You should click the surrender button immediately. <laughs> I can't get my fleet. <laughs> They're bringing armies. Surrender now. Coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. They're landing their armies. We're losing. You're losing ep 2 nils keep. Fine. It's worth it. This is not good. The contingency are everywhere. They've got words written everywhere. The blue. We need to bring the blue in and not be dealing with... Oh, and the contingency are there now. The contingency is still... The, they're in Sol. Look what you've done. They're above my palace. Fine. It's not fine. How is this fine? Oh no, their star base is really strong. Yes, yes, of course it's really strong. What? Surrender. Surrender right now, and then we'll say sorry. Okay, we'll surrender the other war as well. I invited the Pyoran Independent Nation. Oh, we got them. Yeah, that little one, one province minor. Interestingly, that now means that we no longer have, we don't have a majority of votes. No, four Federation members are not under our direct control. They're above Sol. Look what's happening to Sol. Yeah. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh, uh, we just need that one empire. The thing is, they're overwhelming in power to us. It's, they've just been sitting there building up. Oh, and we can't get more than 30 infiltration on them to get the crisis beacon. Just you wait. No subterfuge. All right. No, no, we can. We can. I'm fixing it. Montu fixes. He doesn't just play. He also fixes. Oh, my goodness. The contingency's right next to you in Y. Get out of Y. Y. Did they just engage? straight away did you set their home base to be in the dirk sector um you, you didn't did you i was busy clicking buttons no like make them run because there's so many pop-ups <laughs> death by pop-up it shall be a synth bombs montu's paradise no good and there are now only three people left that could possibly be the prime minister. We're losing leaders left. Like, we have four leaders. Oh, everyone's in our federation. What? The people on the east are in our federation. Did I? Oh, I did. <laughs> I didn't even notice. What the heck? No, they're not. We're missing a couple. Do we? <laughs> There's another federation. The Kelbrun Junction have a federation with those blue people. Oh, I kicked them out at the beginning and now it's come back to bite me in the butt. Oh, we can't even get them really. This is contingency space. We need jump drives. We do have a tier three prospectorium yeah, that's pretty good don't mind if i say so myself nice that's literally our entire economy yeah 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 that that the sidron junction goes down we go down oh no the contingency oh, <laughs> oh I, just, I just saw that happen in serious trying to move around them i'm just gonna go back to making mass corvette fleet because we can't kill them we're making 500 hours a month here and over a thousand research like the amount of ships have gotten killed you don't want to know the contingency is currently fighting five transport fleets perpetually. And the five transport fleets are just making a figure of eight. This is why I don't fight the crisis anymore. I know it's 25 times, but they're just brain dead. Are we fighting the crisis right now? The, apparently. Where have we been fighting the crisis? I haven't seen it fight. I've seen it dying to the crisis, but not fighting. It's just They're just being like a troll. They're not even like a threat. They're just standing still, staring at us. Menacingly. Now, wait, wait, wait. It's my turn to do the crisis beacon. Oh, oh I'd do anything. No, it didn't, did it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got the. Oh, oh. What? 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 I don't care. What have you done? What have you done? We're the Federation leader. No, you didn't, did you? Are we going to win this? I mean, Sol's being bombarded. Oh, my problem. You absolute morons. <laughs> oh my god. Retreat them. I am. Um, I wish we had jump drives. Do not engage the star base, you moron. You. What? What? They engaged it right by the pipeline. No, no, no. Oh, I can't micro the ships at all. Would you like me to take command for a moment? I believe I can do it. Can you, though? <laughs> What? Yeah. 
They just engage. Those fleets must have long range weapons. They're all disruptors. I have a plan. I'm running into the star base. I've set the home base as the star base that's near our enemies. It's not letting me retreat there. Now, we should have fleets in Sirius. Are you serious? I'm serious. Okay, we're here. Look out for the contingency in Sol again. Yeah. Oh, you want Barnard to start? <laughs> what? What do you mean? Go! Please actually win. Victory! We have no transport, so we'll uh, bombard. Yeah, we do. Do we? Oh, no, we don't. Uh, there's 5.9k of contingency coming towards you through Sol. No, they're on serious. No, they're coming! No! Go left. Go left. Right. Left, that's right. Go left. Go left. Go left. Go left. Go left. Left. Left, that's right. Why are you going right? Don't go, go left. Left. Stop. What the... You laggy. Well, you killed one contingency ship with all of that fighting in this entire game. You have managed to kill a single ship. This is so dumb. So, the overall goal was to unite the galaxy oh, and the Federation. Right. Except for the two people we missed out on. Somebody that was a rebellion, a separatist, the Kelbrin Junction, and the xenophobic isolationists. We did get everybody or kill them, didn't we? Because we killed the... Yeah. And the other people were in our Federation at some point. Yeah, they also wouldn't... They didn't count. Yeah. They didn't count. They, they, they were just like hangers on. Let's look at secret goals. So my secret goal today, and I think I've done all right, was to get as many free members of the galaxy to join our federation diplomatically. So I needed to get them to come in as free signed up members. That means that if you're a vassal, you don't count towards that. If there are a vassal or there's someone else's vassal, doesn't count. So who have we got? Let's see. We have Commonwealth of Man. They're not a vassal. We've got the independent Barclan Commissariat. Parian Empires. They're not our vassal. They count. Cool. That's three. Um, is there any others? Ooh, yes. There's the Pyoran Independent Nation. Four. So I think I've managed to get four members to join. I might be slightly off. So my goal was to get vassals in our federation. And we only had three. <gasps> You've beaten me. <laughs> By one. War, I would have won because I would have got two more vassals. If it weren't for those meddling ships. Oh, that was a painful game. Did we complete the overall goal though? I don't know. I'm not sure. Let us know in the comments. Yeah. Did we win? Who knows? You know. Decide today. Right below. Oh. Algorithm stuff. Blah, blah, blah. I just left. I've had enough. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more madness with EP3O, like the time we tried the Stellaris drinking game and almost died, click the video on screen now.